If you have struggled with securing your Kubernetes clusters and enforcing consistent policies across dev, staging, and production environments, then this video is for you. I'm Kapil Anandani, a tech marketing engineer at Nutanix. Today, we are exploring one of the most powerful security tools in Kubernetes ecosystem, OPA and Gatekeeper. These tools are built into Nutanix Kubernetes platform, allowing platform engineers to securely define and enforce policies declaratively across clusters and namespaces. Let's get started. First, let's understand what makes Gatekeeper tick. Think of Gatekeeper as cluster's security gatekeeper, hence the name. It's built all three core components. First, we have Open Policy Agent, OPA. This is the brain that evaluates policies using a language called Rego. Second, constraint templates. These are like blueprints that define what your security rules look like. Think of them as reusable policy templates. And third, constraints. These are the actual enforceable rules that use those templates to secure specific resources in your cluster. And what makes this powerful is Gatekeeper integrates directly with Kubernetes admission control, meaning every request to create, update, or delete resources checked against your policies. Pretty cool, right? Now let's see it in live action. I'm logged into Nutanix Kubernetes Platform dashboard for one of my cluster. First, I'm switching to our production namespace where I want to enforce strict security policies. Here, we already have a constraint template installed. This is one of those pre-built security policies that prevents privilege escalation to root users. Let me show you the rego code that makes this magic happen. See this rego code? It's checking if containers are trying to run as root user. The beauty of rego is that it's declarative. We tell it what we want to enforce, not how to enforce it. Now, as part of this demo, I've created a constraint that monitors pods in our production namespace. I'm going to try deploy a pod that violates our policy, one that runs as a root user. And boom, Gatekeeper just denied our request. The admission web caught this violation and prevented insecure pod from being created. But now let's watch what happens when we deploy a compliant pod. Perfect. The pod is created successfully because it runs as a non-root user. Gatekeeper doesn't just block violations, it also provides comprehensive auditing and observability. You can track policy violations, monitor compliance across your fleet, and even generate reports for your needs, all while maintaining the development velocity we love. I'll see you in the next video. Don't forget to take a test drive and learn more on Nutanix Kubernetes platform.